Well, millions of people get them, and boy, can they be bad. Ask anybody who gets a migraine, and they'll tell you relief can't come quick enough. But there is something new in the pipeline which could change that and help people. Dr. Joe tonight with this, a simple inhaler that's promising to tame the nastiest of headaches. The light bothers you. The smells. Migraine headaches attack the senses. Blurry vision, your eyes start squinting, your head throbs more from trying to focus on anything. Powerful like a summer storm. The last one I had, oh, was really wicked bad. Migraines create a path of havoc and destruction. Started right here in the middle and it worked its way to the top. You just don't want to do anything and you're looking for your Tylenol right away. It's pretty miserable. Yeah, definitely miserable. When people are in pain, they'll, they'll try just about anything. Dr. David Decker is a headache specialist at Florida Hospital Tampa. He sees potential in a new form of an old drug. Actually, it's from a fungus. A fungus that shrinks the throbbing, headache-producing blood vessels of the brain. However, relief has been a bit elusive. It tends to cause a lot of nausea, and so it hasn't been a very popular, a very popular drug. But there are plans to change that. Allergan, the drug company that makes Botox, which is an approved migraine treatment, is banking on a new version of the so-called fungus drug. It's called Levodex and it's delivered by inhaler. I think this would be a useful addition for treating migraine patients. Yes, an inhaler sounds promising, but there is a bit of a problem. Levodex just came up for approval, but the FDA rejected it citing concerns about manufacturing and labeling. The lack of approval doesn't seem to have anything to do with the drug itself at this point. What it seems to be related to is specifically related to the manufacturer of the canisters that, that would contain the medication. Allergan says it's addressing those concerns. The FDA is expected to take another look by the end of the year. A small wait for those with larger-than-life headaches. It would be nice if it worked. Headache relief. That would be great. That would be awesome. Awesome. Possibly delivered with a puff from a migraine inhaler. I'm Dr. Joette Chiavinko, Fox 13 News. If you have a migraine question, you can just check out our My Fox Tampa Bay Facebook page. Earlier this evening, Dr. Joe invited some of the uh, top headache experts from Florida Hospital Tampa to answer your questions. A lot of questions there. They were posted right onto our Facebook page. Just go hit like and you might see an answer to a question that you had about migraines.